ball plate, and it's a transceiver as well. So we always had the three gang. Now we have a two gang, and uh, we still going to keep the three gang coming white or black. Main difference is we're using uh, the new ASEC. How you doing? Um, and uh, it will run cool to the touch. So I know some people don't like warm wall plates. This one will be barely lukewarm at best. Uh, and there's no moving parts in it, no fans, no nothing. Um, and it will uh, also do fiber because of the you know, three gang structure. The two gang will run a little bit warmer, but it will do copper only, and it will do two HDMIs, HDMI out, as well as two USBs and a Ethernet port. Uh, and that is new from our STVE product line. Another interesting one. This is on the Netgear M4500 series switch. And this is their 100 gig aggregator switch. And what we did was we ported our IP based T manager that we use for, for uh, controlling all of the uh, SDVOE products with. Uh, and it's now running right off of their switch itself. And in addition to that, we took our Reax engine, that IP uh, open architecture control engine, and we're running it from inside here as well. So it's the first ever Reax engine running outside of an Aurora product now, now going into a Nikia product, as well as others coming soon too. And that's another new product.